Welcome back. We are live here at 1246. D.C. Police Chief Robert Conti is weighing in on the district's decisions to remove funding for school resource officers. So he was pressed about it after a 15-year-old shot two teens outside of a charter school. Fox 5's David Kaplan has more. The question about whether or not to have school resource officers is one that districts in Maryland and Virginia have taken on, and it's one that D.C. Council grappled with earlier this year, eventually voting to slowly phase out SROs and have none by 2025. Now, reporters asked Police Chief Robert Conti yesterday if he thought SROs could have played a role in stopping what happened just outside the IDEA Charter School yesterday when a 15-year-old shot two other teens. I think incidents like this really uh, underscores the importance of having uh, our school resource officers who are able to uh, really interact with young people in the schools, understand when uh, we have disputes that happen. Mayor Muriel Bowser was on record as supporting school resource officers, but did sign off on the budget council gave her, which took them away. We caught up with her tonight. She says her position hasn't changed. She's calling on council to bring school resource officers back. I think you know that the council voted to take the school resource officers out. But did you, do you, don't you have to sign off on it or? It's part of a $20 billion budget. So it, you're here urging council to try and bring them back into school. My record is clear uh, on needing trusted, known officers and buildings that administrators can count on. Uh, and my position hasn't changed. This past council, the decision to remove SROs by an 8-5 to five vote earlier this year, Samantha Davis and Sion Dubas are with Black Swan Academy, a group advocating for keeping police out of schools. Here's Samantha Davis. We are in alignment with people who are calling for safety, right? We believe in true safety, and what we are trying to push um, when we call for police-free schools is not just the divestment of police from schools, but also the investment and all of the resources um, that we know truly prevent violence from happening, that truly de-escalate, that truly build relationships. Chief Conti was also very frank, adding that having an officer in every single school will not solve every single problem. He does acknowledge that this will require a whole of community approach to stop violence within and around schools. He does feel, though, that police should definitely be part of that equation. Back to you.